a 16 ohm wire is bent to form a square loop. We design the square loop. This is 16 ohm wire, so each side is having the resistance 4 ohm. We can see like this. This is the 4 ohm, this is 4 ohm, this is 4 ohm, and this is 4 ohm. We write here 4 ohm, 4 ohm, 4 ohm, and 4 ohm. A 9 volt battery with internal resistance 1 ohm is connected across one of its side. Let me say we connect a battery having voltage 9 volt and internal resistance 1 ohm. So, this is the connection of the battery. If a 4 microfarad capacitor is connected across one of its diagonal, let me connect the 4 microfarad capacitor. The C capacitance is given by 4 microfarad or you can say 4 into 10 to the power minus 6 joules, 6 farad. The energy stored by the capacitor will be x by 2 microjoules. Answer is coming into microjoules, so keep it in microfarad, do not convert into farad. So, energy across the capacitor is given by half C and voltage across capacitor, let I say this point is A, this point is B. So, voltage across A and B is square. So, C is visible to us. If we calculate the voltage across A and B, we get the answer. Now, all of you know, we will consider it the steady state, and in the steady state, we know. We assume that there is no capacitor in this branch, so we forget this. And what we are writing now, the situation is like this net resistance across this point and this point 4, 4, 4, 12, and 4 parallel. So, you can say 12 into 4 upon 16, 4, 4 is 16, 4, 3 is 12. So, this is 3 ohm. 3 ohm and 1 ohm in series. So, net resistance of the circuit is given by 4 ohm and battery is 9 volt. So, net current which is withdrawn from the battery is given by V by R. So, 9 by 4 that is the net current. This current will split into two part. One is the I 1 and another is the I 2. And of course, if we calculate the I 1 by I 2, of course, I 1 will be less, I 2 will be more because in the I 1 resistance is more 4, 4, 4, 12 and 4. The ratio is given by 4 by 12 or you can say 1 by 3. So, you calculate the value of the I 1, I 1 is given by 1 by 4 into 9 by 4, it is given by 9 by 16. So, this 9 by 16 ampere current is flowing in this A to B path. So, we write the Kirchhoff equation B A minus because current is flowing in same direction. So, 4 for 8, 8 into 9 by 16 equal to V B. So, V A minus V B is given by 8 to the 16, 9 by 2. So, put in this formula, energy is given by half, C is only 4 microfarad because answer is called microjoule into V square that is 9 by 2 into 9 by 2. So, 2 to the 4 and U is given by 81 by 2 microjoule, x is given by 81.